Here is an overview for where you can find and use Spire functions and processes. At the top are menu selections grouped within related areas of your company business. Access records general to the company, including processing options and user security. Customer maintenance and accounts receivable. Vendor maintenance and accounts payable. Inventory item maintenance and relevant transactions. Active and historical purchase orders active and historical sales orders, and more. Many of the records you maintain for processing and accounting can only be found from these top-level menus. On the left side of the Spire main window is the list of modules available to the company. All of these modules can also be opened from the top-level menus, but often this is an easier place to locate and open the place you want to work. Because this is the typical launching point for modules, you can change the position of the modules and organize them the way you want. Perhaps you can put the modules you use most often at the top, or arrange related modules together. In general, selecting a module from the left side, or from the respective top-level menu, will open a grid in the Spire main window that lists associated records and transactions. And when accessing transactions, records, or settings from the top-level menu that aren't listed in the module area, will be opened in an independent window for display or further editing. For the module that is open, there often are tabs at the top that contain information for different processes, or access to related records, or providing a different view into the data, or printing reports for this module. Common toolbar buttons at the top provide standard functionality for each module, such as creating, or changing, or deleting records, searching for something, exporting the grid to Excel, printing reports, or getting help. Many modules also have toolbar buttons that toggle on a status or run a specific procedure for one or more records or transactions highlighted in the grid, active only when the associated record can use them. And toolbars can be rearranged to organize the layout and make it easy to find the buttons you want. When new records are created, or existing records are edited, a new screen is opened that gives the user access to the information stored within. Like the module list, these windows also have toolbars for common and process-specific functions, perhaps two separate toolbars for both the header and detail areas of transactions. And for organization, multiple tabs exist to group related information when it would be overwhelming or impossible to display everything on one screen. Tabs may also be available to display other transactions related to this record, or processes to assist with entry. Sometimes a system message appears at the top of the window, either as information or a warning, when particular data conditions are met, such as inventory being in stock to cover back orders, or there are important notes to read. You can follow this call to action or dismiss it as required. Spire allows using previous and next record navigation to open a different record, even while in edit mode, if you are browsing for something specific or making updates to multiple records. If you made any changes not yet saved, you will be prompted to do so before moving to another record. Fields with a magnifying glass indicate that information can be entered not only by typing the associated code, but also with a lookup or search capability. Click the magnifying glass to open a full list of defined codes to choose from. Or start typing to have a ranked list appear below, not only to list codes that start with what you have typed, but also records that have other key information stored on the record, such as a contact or phone number. Some grids, such as for transaction details, allow entering information directly into the column cells, rather than from a separate window. This can make it more efficient to enter or update multiple details in succession. Use the Tab key to move focus to the next editable field on the right, or Shift tab to go to the left, the up or down arrow keys to move to another row within the same column, or the Enter key to start a new detail on the next row. Color is used throughout Spire to bring focus to important information. Certain fields or cells may have color to represent an important data condition. You can manually assign color to records so that whenever they are listed in grids, a visual cue is there to represent a scenario of interest.
Tab names like communications can have color to show that there are notes available that the user should read and be aware of.